Okay, I'm working on Santa now, and uh, of course the face is the crucial thing. I have the better part of him painted. If you can pan over, you can see the model I'm using for the face, blown up on a copier, and the progress I've made so far. Obviously, one of the things remaining is to do his mouth. So I have a red-brown color, and I'm going to do the whole mouth in red-brown. And then I'm going to come back and put some pink and little lines there that will make him look like he's got a creased, uh, slightly wrinkled look. I'm looking at this color image here for references. And I'm going to make it as close to the original artwork as possible and then do some variations that seem appropriate. Okay. I can mix up a little more red and start in on this red nose. I'm using the poor man's airbrush, which is to say finger paint. This gives an airbrush look without having to get your airbrush tuned down so finely. And again, it looks like red cheeks, but it's not truly red. It's more of an Indian red brown. Okay, got a lot of color in his cheeks. Let's see what else we need this color. See really high there. And a lot of it on this cheek. I've already done a basic flesh color, followed by a pale version of the basic flesh color, followed by dark brown, red brown of the basic flesh color, followed by pure white for the highlights, and finally this reddish brown. Then I'm going to go back with white and bring the hair in so that I get more fuzziness out of him. One thing the finger smearing does is allow you to somewhat imitate the irregularness of people's skin tones. And a little saliva never hurt. Okay. This is going to be white hair, and that, I believe, is an earlobe. Santa's got some pretty uh, serious ears. Sometimes, when you're lucky, you can just let the brush work stand on its own. Okay, I think this needs to be a little wider. Now I'm going to 
come into that with some pink. Okay. <clears throat> we'll come back later when he's done. Okay, Santa Claus is finished. The face took a lot of attention. You can see the colors had to be made much more subtle. And I need to finish off the shadows on the hat. And behind him is his sack of toys, which is the gray-brown color. This will be the top lip of it. And these shapes will all be toys sticking out. I haven't decided what they are. I have to find a toy appropriate to the shape of the, the bag. Um, and then I need to improve his FAA N number, which all private planes and aircraft get, a number that starts with N. It's, it's down below where you can't see it. Okay, here's a close-up of Santa's face. And I was trying to get happiness and jolliness but I think if you look at it carefully, it's more an expression of surprise that uh, he just had an aha. I think he just realized that he's not real. <laughs>